one of the worst phone sex proponents ever. That's but been none, my experience. Nonetheless, compared to what? Well, I, I, this is good. This is a good deep dig. Uh, I will tell you that I met Prince Charles, now known as King George, or sorry, King Charles you, III. He's, <laughs> yes, he's on the way. Uh, I was about five years ago um, staying at the I, Athenaeum in London and taking a little shortcut across the green. And Google purposely, as you know, strips out of its apps uh, certain things that you're not supposed to be able to find, like Chuckles House near where the queen lives. So I'm crunching along the gravel at night. This is probably at one in the morning. And I'm looking at Google Maps, and I think I'm simply on a path. But it's a gravel path. And I go by a little hut. And there's a guy looking at his uh, cell phone, looking at Facebook, a guard of some sort. And I crunch up, and I walk into the bumper of a Jaguar. Ew. And the door is open of the Jaguar, and there is now the queen consort Camilla with yeah. her feet out, touching the gravel, her dress pulled up high on her knees, and chuckles hanging over the door saying, nighty night. And I walk, and they both turn and look, and he says, well, why, hello. <laughs> and I said, well, hello. And then the guards come up behind me, and I realize, oh. This could be bad. Tower of London time. Yes. So I come up with the only reasonable sentence that would get me out of there. Oh, I'm American. <laughs> <laughs> you are. Live. 